Relaxing as you exhale. Recognizing that you're in a protected setting among good people. You're also a strong person. You have strengths that can enable you to deal with challenges so that you can afford to let unnecessary anxiety fall away. Letting unnecessary bracing or guarding or tension or vigilance fall away. Letting any unfounded sense of threat fall away. And coming home and resting more and more deeply in a growing sense of peace. a level of peace, a space of peace that can contain anxiety or uncertainty. With peace at your core. Letting a growing sense of peace move to the back of the mind and focusing now on encouraging gently and authentically a growing feeling of contentment, a sense of well-being with no wish for this moment to be any other than the way it is. You can help grow this sense of contentment by bringing to mind things that you feel grateful for or glad about. Encouraging feelings of gratitude or gladness to fill your mind. (coughs) Thinking of things that make you feel happy or contented. As contentment grows, there's a falling away of any frustration or disappointment or drivenness. No need for any of that. And then letting the sense of contentment move to the back of the mind and finding a growing sense of love. Calling to mind beings who care about you, even if it's an imperfect relationship.
calling up experiences of feeling included or liked or loved. opening to receive these experiences of feeling liked or loved, being warm and caring toward yourself to let yourself actually feel these things. Also being aware of your own warm-heartedness, your compassion and kindness and caring and love for others. Loved and loving. And as your mind and heart and body are increasingly filled with love, there's a falling away of any kind of struggle with other people. Envy falls away, hurt falls away. Any kind of chasing of others or trying to be important or impressive. So all that falls away, no need for it. Greening the heart in effect with love. And then as we take just a few more moments to finish up, a more global or integrated sense of peace, contentment, and love all together. Your home base, a sense of coming home. Disturbance or deficit falling away, craving falling away. present here at home. There's a saying in Tibet and elsewhere that if you take care of the minutes, the years will take care of themselves. And that's our opportunity, minute by minute, breath by breath, to you know, see the good that is available to us and to uh, be a friend to ourselves, in part out of service to others, to grow the good over here so we have more to offer to them. And to look for that good and really letting it land and coming into an intimacy with it 
for many reasons. Simply to enjoy life more, to show up more for the good that's here instead of whoop, missing it as it goes on by. Right? Also to grow various resources, psychological resources, inner strengths inside, to deal with life, to be more effective, to be more successful, to be more skillful in relationships, to do that. And also, if this interests you, to gradually internalize so much good inside that craving falls away. There's less and less of a basis for it. There's no basis for it. And you're more and more able to, as it said, walk increasingly evenly over uneven ground through equanimity. Not underestimating the power of little experiences, gradually internalized and accumulated over time. Quoting the Buddha here, he said, think not lightly of good, saying, it will not come to me. Drop by drop is the water pot filled. Likewise, the wise one, gathering it little by little, fills oneself with good. May you and I fill ourselves with good. May we help others fill themselves with good for our own sake and in widening ripples, known and unknown, seen and unseen, eventually, hopefully, helping the whole wide world. <laughs>